It could be fear of what people think about you. It could be fear of your finances. You may be sitting here today and you may be fearing if you're even going to heaven. Or maybe in your relationships or if you're married. Or maybe you're single. And you're like, Lord, I'm ready. Where are you at? Or you're married and you're miserable. And you're like, Lord, where's that rapture at you promised? <laughs> We've all had that sometimes, you know. <laughs> if you've been married for any amount of time, you've had those, you've had those run through your head. <laughs> but it can cause us to live in fear, to have a scarcity mindset, and a knee-jerk reaction for you to never feel like you're enough or other people are never enough. Or money is never enough. You know, money is not evil, but the love of money is the root of it. Money's good. I can buy all the peanut butter cups I want with some money. And now, now they got them where it's like low carb. What is that brand? Quest. Yeah. Boy, I go by a gas station. I'm giving me some peanut butter cups. I don't care if I just ate. I'm going to give me, oh, ooh, yes, Lord. Mm. <laughs> Easter time's coming. Oh, those ones that look like Easter eggs. Mm -hmm. I don't know why they taste better, but they do. In Jesus' name. <laughs> Hallelujah. Oh.